Hello guys, welcome to my channel. You are watching how to fix stack. In this video, I am going to show you how to make your USB or pen drive bootable so that you can install Windows 10 from bootable pen drive or other media. So basically you need two software for that. First is ISO file and second is Rufus software. ISO we will get from Microsoft and the Rufus is the software by which you can make your pen drive bootable. So first go to Google Chrome or your favorite browser. Okay here you need to type window 10 as a file. I should download also you can try. Okay. The first link you will get the from Microsoft download Windows 10 disk image ISO file. Click on this link. I will this link into my description box as well. So you can directly access this website. Okay. Now you will see page like this. You need to scroll it down. And after you scroll it little bit down, you can see the create window 10 installation media. Click on this download tool now option. Okay. And this is the tool of ISO file. You need to download it and run it. So let me download this tool. And also you will get the latest Windows 10 file from this official website of Microsoft. Now you can see .exe media creation tool is downloaded now. Let me show you in the download. You can directly run this from here, but this is the tool. Okay. I'm going to cut it and paste it to the desktop so that you can see it. Okay. Now you can see this is the media creation tool. Okay, you need to double click on it like this. Click on yes button when prompt opens. Now Windows 10. Now we are downloading the ISO file and after that we will make the bootable pen drive with the help of Rufus. Let me download this file first. Now you will see the accept term terms license. You need to accept this terms. Click on accept option. Okay, now you will see options like this upgrade this PC and create installation USB flash drive DVD or ISO file. We need to make ISO file. Click on this. Okay. Now you need to click on next button. Now you can choose your as per your system requirement. If you are using 32 bit system, you can choose that one. In my case, I'm using 64 bits operating system. Click on this option. And also tick this option use recommended setting for this PC. Click on next button. Now you will see two options USB flash drive ISO file. Okay. You can directly make the ISO file and bootable pen drive with the help of this option USB flash drive. Okay. Once you click on next like this, you can choose the, your removable disk. You can see it has already detected it. Let me show you. Okay. This is my pen drive. You can see the 14 GB win setup. Okay. It is by default taken it, but you can directly click on next button and this process is going to make your bootable pen drive directly. This process will automatically make your USB bootable pen drive. You can see the options progress is 0%. Okay. One way you can choose this one and I'm going to show you the second option which is ISO file how you can download the file. Let me cancel this option first. Now again choose the same option.
I'm going to making now you will see the options two options likewise I have previously told you you need to click on ISO file you can save this ISO file for long time on your windows so this will be the better option for you to saving your ISO file as well if your window is corrupted and ISO file you need to re-download it but if you save your ISO file on your desktop or on your system so this will be better option for you click on next option ISO file okay now you need to choose the location of ISO file so this is the location of my ISO file you can name it windows 10 ISO okay like this I am saving it on a desktop click on save button here and this process is going to 0 to 100 percent you need to wait for the process to complete okay since I have already downloaded the Windows 10 ISO file, I am not going to download Windows 10 ISO file. Okay, you will see the Windows ISO file like this. You can see here, this is the disk image of ISO file. So how to make your pen drive bootable so that you can install fresh Windows. Go to Google browser again. We need to download one more software which is called Rufus. Okay search on a Rufus on a search bar then hit enter you should see the first link of official website https.rufus.ie I will give this link into my description box so you can see that and you can use the option Just scroll it down okay now click on the section which is called download button and click on the Rufus 3.20 which is the latest version for the time I am making the video but uh, whenever you get this video you need to download the latest option and now you need to double click on it setup to run ok I have double click on this option click on yes button when the prompt opens now minimize this option ok now you will see options like this insert your pen drive since i have already inserted my pen drive you can see the option okay windows set you can choose the capacity and storage of your pen drive and name as well you need to verify that you are choosing the right pen drive and usb and other media okay here the disk or ISO file image should be selected here it is by default selected what you need to change you need to click on select option ok you need to choose the ISO file which you have downloaded since I have downloaded it on a desktop you can see options click on desktop option now you will see window 10 ISO click on open button here after selecting it ok now I have selected the ISO file from the desktop what you need to choose is partition scheme you can choose MBR if you are using the old model and I suggest you to leave it by default ok like this the label name ok and file system should be NTFS you need to choose this option okay this is the latest version from the file system so you need to choose NTFS okay now click on start button okay click on ok buttons your all the data will be deleted from the pen drive so you can backup your data from pen drive click on ok click on ok it is prompting that your all the data will be destroyed click on ok you can see the process is uh, beginning and it's formatting the pen drive so you need to wait for the process after that I will show you my pen drive how it will look after making the bootable pen drive
this is time taking process you need to wait for the process to complete almost 10 to 15 minutes i am fast forwarding this video to save your time Okay, now you can see the process is completed and it's ready to use. You can install the Windows 10 from the ISO file. You need to click on close options and make sure it is green as I am displaying you. Okay, now close it and let me show you how it will look. Okay, now you can see this is the Windows 10 ISO file, how this will look. And there are the files inside your windows, inside your pen drive. Okay. So this is how you can make the Windows 10 ISO file easily. Hope this video is helpful for you. If yes, then don't forget to like this video and subscribe my channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. How to fix tech.